Hello everybody, welcome back to more Enter the Gungeon Mod the Gungeon. We got speed up. Okay, speed up. Rate of fire down. Spread is okay. Damage is bad. Oh god. Reload time better. Alright, you know what? All in all, it looks pretty decent. Roll time and roll distance are... Yeah, technically, we have a point two benefit on our roll, but it covers a little less distance. I don't really care that much. That's that's a okay. I mean, you know, items mean a lot, and for items we're okay. Like <laughs> whatever, sure. Supply drop, uranium amulet, and the hunter's starter. I'm cool with it. Did I already press this? I think I already pressed this. All right. Here we go. There is a special thing we are going to be testing out today. This is an interesting place to, ooh, to start this room. There's a new floor in town, and I am here to test it. <laughs> we're going to be checking out. There's a, we did, a, I think we were talking about it in the last episode. Uh, but there is a new floor coming out. Uh, the belly of the Beast, I believe it's called. And to go there... We do need to go to the jungle first, so we're gonna be we're gonna be doing that. And worst comes to worst, we are going to give ourselves like you know, uh, an, the ability to to make fire or or an extra key or something today. Like I like I'll try not to need to to go to these places to showcase you know kind of what you need to do in a normal way to get to them. However, yeah, I just want to see it. <laughs> I want to see it, so we will mod in whatever we need to to make it work. Zooming in and out of my microphone, like getting you some uh, some Doppler effect action. This was a uh, an interesting, interesting, wow, interesting, interesting way to go about this here. All right, so we got our first hit. Off to a great start. Off to the races. I gotta adjust my dang chair there so we can just get the Doppler effect garbage out of the way. There we go. But I'm excited to check out the new floor. I feel like, you know, just a, just a change of scenery goes a long way. You know, just look, <laughs> just look at the world right now. A change of scenery sounds fantastic right now. But, you know, just, just getting different sprites on the wall different tile set looks great you know uh okay super irrelevant brothers melee very irrelevant uh we are going to be going to the the jungle which we do need two keys that's why i did junk that chest instead of opening it otherwise i might have might have opened it for people who are like, uh, yeah, why do you junk the brown chests? Usually it's so that I can go to the dang secret floors. You know, if I, like, not a lot of brown chests show up past this floor. Like, you'll get some on uh, the alt floor, you'll get some on the second floor. Should I do this? I'm actually, I'm gonna do this. I think we, we, we oh, I think I regret it. We should get enough to get the key. But we might also just get a key, you know? Oh, I've done a bad thing. Oh, that was almost godlike. I did a bad thing there. All right, well, we got two coolness, so a uh, Vorpal Gun may actually be not so bad. Not that it's, it's never been bad. It's always just been like, I don't know, it's not, it's not god tier unless you get high, high, high coolness. And then it's like... Dear God, this thing. It's nuts. Hup, hup. But without it, it's kind of just like, a, it's a pretty good above average gun with a basically a non-existent chance to create unless you have high, 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 high uh, coolness. Holy moly. But we're getting a lot now. How the hell is it hot in here? All right. It's hot in here for anyone else. <laughs> It always like, I always want to talk like y'all are in the freaking room. What do you think about what do you think about the weather outside right now, man? Can you believe that? Why is my cat uh, Why is my cat so sad outside? Do you guys know? I sure as hell don't. 
Uh, I feel like this might be a new room. Doesn't feel familiar to me. I, at least I don't think I've ever seen it. So that probably means it's uh, one of the new ones added in uh, in the update to Never Name's item or uh, a room pack, rather. Uh oh. Yeah, I kind of kind of saw that coming from a, a mile away. Okay. Easy, uh, easy junking. Now my chair's breaking. What is happening today? What is happening today? Now my chair's broken. It's hot in here. My cat is sad. And all I got is this stinking Vorpal gun with 14% damage down. At least our boss damage is not also super down. Okay, well. Them crits, though. The crits don't care about our damage down. That helps a lot. Mine, nerves, bullets, I would l actually love them. I like all those ones that are just, uh, this one shots this type of enemy. I, I actually dig them a lot. Don't you dare shoot that barrel. Don't you dare all shoot that barrel. Okay, get to the side. Is this the final phase? Or is there one more? Okay. We're gonna fight the boss, hope we get another key so that I can buy Minecraft the bullets. I'm sorry, minor bullets. Thank you, crit. That's really what we're relying on to do the big number right now. I'm almost tempted to just fire off and hope we crit, because you do crit through walls when you crit. Okay. Get the hell away from me so I can call down this. Oh no. <laughs> it could have been pretty bad. Did we crit him out of the animation? Is that a thing? I didn't think that was a thing. Okay. But yeah, Vorpal. Vorpal for this room actually is quite nice. See, look at that. Crit him behind the pillar. Boom! Crit behind the pillar! Stone Dome. At 50! Oh, yes. That is nice. Okay. Now we get the miner's bullets. We can one-shot any enemy that is shaped like a cube. So it's just like, it's a great way to conserve, uh, conserve ammo. Boop, boop. Okay, we gotta be careful. So, let's just, so we don't take damage. Let's wait until it's dissipated. All right. Because, yes, it doesn't seem like you should take damage. But uh, I, I don't, I've had times where I've definitely popped down here and, uh, and I've had fire in my body. Don't know what that's about. But it's okay. We can just exercise a little bit of patience. So basically, as far as I'm aware, what we are doing today is going to be really similar to what we normally need to do. Oh, what we normally need to do to get to the Abbey. Oh, that's true. God, I do not want to take that hit, even though I have a, even though I got a shield on. So I believe there is a crest we need to uh, to take, and if we, <laughs> I, I'm tempted to like just give myself invincibility. Ability, just in case there's not a way to like script it back onto my body in case I do get hit like I know it's just don't get hit forehead but like sometimes it ain't that easy sometimes baloney strikes it's not often but uh, it only baloney only needs to strike once baloney only is a very fun thing to say though I got I gotta say Baloney only. Everybody to yourself. A, a, a comment of the day. But in real life. To yourself. Quietly or uh, or out loud. Or maybe even in your head. Do yourself a favor. Say baloney only. Oh my god, that feels great. <laughs> oh boy. It's a good, it's a good, it's a good episode already, ain't it? We <laughs> Technical difficulties... Room temperature adjustments, cat cries, baloney only. 
but I think that my, my guess is this uh, the special thing that we need to pick up is going to be in the place where the other crest normally was. This is uh, not as satisfying of a gun with this low of damage. I would love, love a damage up. Just to put us back into like normal turf would be cool. Uh-oh. God, I love the fear though. I love the fear. It helps with all these stinkers. Uh-oh. Please, please, please. Let me sneak it in there. Let me sneak it in through there. I know you're all scared, but just come on, stand still. I'm only a little scary. Baloney only. Man, it's gonna be in my head forever. All right. I, I always think then, and this stuff is like, it's gone, it's gone at the end of the episode. Somebody, somebody's gonna comment on my uh, on the next episode, baloney only, and I'm gonna be like, what the hell are you talking about? <laughs> Even though I just said, I'm gonna remember this forever. I'll, for I'll forget it tomorrow. I'll uh, forget it tomorrow. But maybe, maybe I've secured it now. It's the kind of thing where I, I, I've, I've grown pretty accustomed to how the YouTube, <laughs> the YouTube comment section psychology works out. Now that I've talked about it this long and said that nobody's gonna like, nobody will do it, I'll forget about it. Nobody will let me forget about it. And then it'll get to the point where one month from now, th this is just like, it's a sociology experiment, this whole, uh, <laughs> baloney only thing I, I've literally just crafted in my head right now is it's a social thing like now is going to be talked about so much that somebody's going to be saying it on stream over and over in the in the in the section and I'm going to be <laughs> I'm going to be annoyed that it's the only thing I see but now maybe that I've said this they'll be self-aware enough however there's always someone who's not self-aware enough so you know what Somebody can write their uh, their dang uh, college thesis on this sucker. Huh. Baloney only a case study. Huh. All right, that oh that was so that was slick. Crit him through his own bubble. That can feel good. That was okay. Vorpal though. Actually helping a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton, a ton. Is our accuracy bad? Not really. It's uh, in fact, it's technically better. I guess the Vorpal just has a, a worse accuracy than I remember. Because I don't when I when I pick up the uh, uh the accuracy when I pick up the Vorpal gun, I don't really think about the accuracy because I'm not really thinking about the bullets. When you think of Vorpal, or when I think of Vorpal, I think of the Vorpal shots. Go freaking figure. Oh my god. I don't like critting. I'm a little light sensitive. And by a little, I mean, I'm like, I'm pretty light sensitive. At least that's what chat, chat and uh, the comment section let, lets me know is like, how dare you be a baby? You, you can't handle this light? What? It gives you a, <laughs> it gives you a migraine? You're gonna cry about it? <laughs> You're gonna cry about it? Absolutely. Migraines don't feel good. Oh boy. Oh. I'm just like ready for uh, for crits on this too. Oh man. Oh no. I would really like another. <laughs> oh, way to do damage. That was a tight dodge. Ammo would be oh no 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 oh no 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 this could be bad I do have to remember that fighting them this early means that they do have a lower HP pool but like okay yep that helps a lot the lower HP pool really makes them a lot less annoying since they do really just run the hell around can be annoying to try to, to keep track of them, grab them before they, uh, they get into a corner and do some nastiness, dupe himself. Yet, yet, sir, 
sir. Nothing feels worse than chasing down an enemy while you do noodle damage. All right. Okay. Up here. We've not run into a lot of cubes. That was kind of my hope. Oh. I think we go for the bop, 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 bop. It just lasts a long time. All right. Stand still. Very good. <laughs> Just stand in the corner. Bop, bop, bop. Stand in the... Shop. I need keys. I need keys? I would love two keys at least, please. The fabled three key shop I have seen before. But it is not common. Oh. Okay, now give me a two key and... Yeah, I mean, I'm... I was dreaming. I was dreaming if I thought I'd get a, a two key. I'll take a demon head, though. I'm going to open this up. I'm not going to pick it up, though, if it is indeed here. Oh, it's... Look at that. It's dapper as hell. That's a nice little sprite. So it's the wooden... What? Wooden crest? Wooden... Is it just called wooden, wooden crest? Wooden shield? I'll look up and see if I can, like... Just in case. Okay. I can give it to myself in, just in case. I'm going to do my best to not lose it, though. Whoop. Because then I will... Uh, I will get called bad at the video game if I lose the crest. And God knows. I don't want that to happen. Um... Uh, I feel like we might do more damage with this since the fire doesn't get a penalty from our big 15% uh, damage down. Yeah, I feel like send him on fire and then bop, bop, bop. Set him on fire, then bop, bop, bop. That is That sounds like a straight out of Parappa the Rapper. Set him on fire. <laughs> That's the cut level where Parappa turns into a psychopath. <laughs> Set him on fire and bop, bop, bop. Set him on fire and bop, bop, bop. Just gotta believe. <laughs> that is, uh... That is an image. I always, like... Parappa the Rapper, like, I always got creeped out by, a, a, like, a lot of stuff. Like, that seems like it's kind of visually geared towards kids, but is not necessarily only meant to be for kids. Like, I feel like a lot of the times it kind of, like, and I'm not talking just, like, Spongebob or, like, you know, I don't know, like, that has that weird Uncanny Valley vibe to it, but Parappa never did it for me. What is this? What the hell is this? Bullets. Missing description increases damage for each carried blank. Blank bullets is a joke. Increases damage for each carried blank. Whoever created these bullets was clearly too lazy to make anything uh, anything beyond a void in time and space. Oh, man. It's good. A screw fell out of my chair. That's what's happening, everyone. I just thought you were all very, maybe going to be very, very curious about why my chair was uncomfortable today. A screw fell out, and the arm's not in the right spot. There we go. Wooden crest protection of food. Shield made of wood provides fleeting protection. All right. I can only imagine we need to take it to the same place. But I don't even know. I don't even know. Is some Marlin. Oh, I love it. Oh. And it's gone. Set him on fire. <laughs> bop, bop, bop. All right. So, do not get hit. Even though we got the blank bullets. Oh, my God. Even though we got the blank bullets and we kind of want to save them to an extent, I am more... Uh, 
God. I didn't delete this room from my pack. No! I don't like this one. It takes up too much ammo. I don't like this one. It takes up too much ammo. I mean, maybe the duck does bonus damage. I don't know. There's certain things where I'm like, does it do? Does it scale off of our damage or does it scale off of something else? I assume the duck does scale off of our damage. Blazing beaks. Go watch that series. If you ain't gonna give Monster Train a, a chance, at least give Blazing Beaks a chance. I, but give Monster Train a, a chance. It's a fantastic, fantastic game. Best, I think it's maybe the best deck builder I've ever played. I, I know it's early, but it is so good. So, 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 so good. If you wanna get into deck builders, it's a, it's a really fun place to start. Oh, wait, what happened to my, do I have the crest? I do, I do, okay. I do. It's just not visually up there. I gotcha. Gotcha. But I do have it. Good deal. Good deal. I, I'm imagining if we go there it'll 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 know. Okay. Oh that feels amazing! I love to see that. The Minecraft bullets are, are one of my uh, one of my favorite ones of the one-shot bobs because just the, a lot of the cubes show up a lot of times and they just have so much more HP than you would oh no normally think. I also think this room should be removed from my pack. I'll be honest. It's just like it's a lot, man. If we didn't have these homing bullets. course they're gonna be through the uh through the the mini boss room probably where we need to go that's my educated guess it usually feels like that's the way that the dungeon flow works is that stuff you want is through the mini boss room or like the boss or the exit a lot of times what is our damage at? our damage is at 1.06 wow I mean, like, I don't want to ever blank. Because I'll miss you, blank. And I don't want to miss a thing. Uh, I don't know if I care today. We're going to double floors. We're going to double floors. What? Okay, gee, I, won I wonder. Gee, I wonder where it's supposed to go. You think it maybe goes here? Oh. So you cannot go to both. Thank God. The game does not need to be any longer, in my opinion. I don't want to blank at all. I want to just save the damage. I'd rather get hit and take the damage than lose the damage. Because if we don't blank at all, we get to bring these four blanks to the next floor. We can potentially stack it up even more basically like I, i'm i'm really a fan of these blank bullets right now because they actually do propose they pose an interesting st strategic risk reward choice because like uh, no, yes your blanks go to two at the uh oh that's a tough choice though your blanks go to two at, at the end of every floor the beginning of every floor is if you have less than two but if you have more than two they do carry over so Why'd I do it? Come on. Give me a crit. Thank you. Do we have more coolness now? We only have, we still only have two coolness. Like a couple crits happen in a row and all of a sudden you're like, man, I must have gotten a lot because it just doesn't, it doesn't feel normal. Can we buy keys? Key? Key. Well, key. I think I will maybe spend a blank to get that chest slash armor room up there. I think that might be worth it. Okay. I think this is maybe a new room too. 
noticing quite a few uh, newer seeming runes. Hey! Yep. Oh no! Oh no! I don't. I think that's counterintuitive. Thank you for the armor. Oh no! It put me there. It put me there. Why? Why? <laughs> this wasn't worth it at all. Well, well, well. It kind of was. I, I don't want the uh, the full metal jacket today, because it completely goes against the meme I'm trying to do, which is, I want to get the big number. You know, like, if, if you don't know what Full Metal Jacket does, it makes it so when we get hit, instead of taking damage, we use one of our blanks. Which is all well and dandy, except I just want to store my blanks so I get more damage. That's all. What's so wrong about that? I think we can warp a little bit. We might be able to crit her while she's in Vizzo. Yep. Yep. I think we save it for when she's uh, under the water. When she's under the sea. Under the sea. Okay. This is not... Come on. It's hilarious to do it. Yes! Yeah! Get wrecked. Okay. Shotgun full of hate. Amazing. Fill up that Vorpal. Anything left? There is, but we don't have any keys for it. I say we do a couple munches. To get... Maybe a new gun. I don't really like I know we're getting rid of a newer gun, but we've used we have used the ornate pistol a lot. It is pretty good. Alright, well. Well. So this doesn't uh this doesn't link back up. Interesting. Interdasting. Is that why there's that weird one shot off the beaten path room over here. Uh, here. Is that why? Oh, well. Off I go then. Boy, this looks... This looks fun. Uh. We shipwrecked chasing a terrible monster. Managed to lure and trap it in this weird dungeon full of living bullets. Alas, I could not slay the beast, but managed to trap it in this chamber. I used a teleporter prototype to teleport the key to this chamber far away. I don't know where it ended up, but I hope no one finds it. Whoops. Hmm. <laughs> I tried. I tried to get the key. Well, guess I'm eating. Oh, heck. I guess we gotta go see what the new floor is since we've been eating. Oh, God. What is... Got some some serious... The Dango is... With the Dango's Cavern vibes? Or, uh, I... Oh, oh, look at that. Disgusting. Okay. Oh, yep. Inside, or some serious inside monstro vibes. Okay, I don't know if, um... I'm not sure if these are custom-made rooms for this floor yet or not. I know there's going to be more. I'm not sure if these are or not, though. This one doesn't really feel very familiar. And it would, you know, conceptually, it would, I think it would make sense to see a lot of, a lot of skeletons inside. Yeah, I, I could see that. Oh my god, 
god, the noise. Oh, it's so... It's so goopy. And look at all them skeletons. Oh, my god. It's good. It's good. Holy moly. Oh, no! Do I have the... Can I jump that? I, I have a distance down, so... This is quite the jump, though. It's quite quite the jump that they're expecting of you there. Oh, man. I just realized how much the, uh, the door close sound effect normally s uh, reminds me that I'm entering a... R a room and there's enemies like it's just like a like a Pavlovian thing uh, Pavlovian Pavlovian Pavlov style Oop. Okay, these these feel pretty new These feel pretty new. I don't think I've ever seen these before. But yeah, like, every single floor has the same door clo closed noise, and I just realized that. Oh my god. Okay, all the, like, blobs make sense, too. Like, I'm thinking these are, I'm thinking these are custom made. Otherwise, whatever the floor, like, the, uh, the hollow, which maybe it is taking the hollow? It's definitely not taking the minor stuff. Kind of makes sense to see these guys here, too. Yeah, I think so. So far, so far, seems about uh, about right to me that these are all new new floor uh, new rooms for the floor. Okay. So far, feels feels appropriately difficult. Uh, if we're comparing it to like the Abbey of the True Gun. It might be a bit easier than that, maybe? I, I feel like wh whether or not it's easier than the Abbey the True Gun entirely depends on the, um... Depends on the trap rooms. Because that's always my least favorite part of the Abbey the True Gun. There's some, uh, there's some pretty janky trap rooms in there. And I guess it probably depends on the, uh, on the boss as well. I do wonder who it's gonna... Who's it gonna be? Is it just gonna be a fourth floor boss, or, uh... Is it going to be the old king, but instead he's inside the, uh, the belly of the beast? Or is there even going to be a boss? I don't even know, man. I love how it is all just like... The, the dungeon flow being one long path makes a lot of sense. If you think of, uh, you know, the journey of food. Let's just say that. We're going to get full on uh, uh, Osmosis Jones at the end of this here. If you know what I'm saying. It's my educated guess. Oh, this room's a little, t a little bit trickier. I wouldn't say it's unmanageably tricky because I, I just I didn't get hit. So <laughs> it can't be unmanageably tricky. I'm going to forget that I'm trying to save my blanks. I'm, I'm, I'm well aware of that. Like, I uh, compare this to, like, um, the, uh, the, 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 what is it, the freaking, uh, <laughs> no, the womb in, uh, in Isaac. Compare this to that, it's way, way easier to look at. The green's pretty extreme, but it, like, I don't know, it doesn't bother me that much. It, it's way easier to look at than that, uh, that bright red vibe. But I dig it. Yeah, it kind of reminds me of the, uh, the, yeah, like, you know, the Dongo's Cavern. Uh, I, mean, I think that's what it was, right? In, in, in Ocarina of Time. Uh, and then, obviously, like, oh, boy. Yeah, I like I like these hollies. They're a nice touch. Uh, but, yeah, inside inside Monstro and Kingdom Hearts, that kind of stuff. So many games have, and then you go in the monster... And it just seems like, it seems fitting to, to, to see it here, too. I don't know. I like it. I dig it. Glass smelter. So we get the, uh... Yeah, I'm not gonna find it. I'm not gonna open a secret room anyway. 
We get the three glass stones now, and then on every floor. You know what? I gotta know. What's what's down here? I mean, more more rooms, but of course, but like, but like, how far does it go? How big is this floor? Up. <gasps> no! There's a chest down there. Somebody, please. Why do you swallow these dang cannonballs? What's wrong with you, you dingus? Well, I guess. Oh, cause they got the the lures. They got shipwrecked. These are the people who got shipwrecked. Oh, that's great. These are the people who got shipwrecked. That's fantastic. But yeah, keys would be fantastic. I would squee for a key. That is what I decree. Holy moly. But it's a, yeah, it's a, the same thing is kind of just like the only thing that would make it like better at this point is if those one wants to be a uh, an absolute champion and make us a gun gun track to go for this floor i wonder if they were like i mean you know this was like an in development floor it wouldn't you know maybe there's a possibility that there's something somewhere kind of like in dev that was in dev who knows i wonder Because they all have their own, they all have their own unique song, right? Don't they? Maybe the Abbey and the maybe the Abbey doesn't. Maybe the sewers doesn't. Maybe they don't. Huh? I don't even remember now. It's been so long. Ah, uh, that guy is so fitting. So fitting for here. It's so meta, being eaten inside of a beast. We'd have to go through two digestive tracks to get out. Boss. I'm curious. My guess is it is just for now and maybe forever. I don't know. Just, uh, I don't know, like a, a, a fourth floor boss. It's up top, though. I don't know. Maybe the old king. Oh boy. Don't want to go up there. Oh, no. Key. All right. What do we got? Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Oh, that makes a lot of sense. Parasite horror, parasitic abomination. That makes a lot of sense. And I don't really have practice fighting this son of a gun. Oh my god. Oh, I love it. Oh, I love it. I love that there's an excuse to fight these this stinker outside of the dang marine pass. This this was genius. This was genius. Oh, this was genius. He'd at you the madman. The madman! The absolute madman. You've had done yourself. You've had done yourself. This is so much this is so much better than anything I anticipated. Oh my god. Oh I love it. Oh my god. Huh. I wonder if there's any, anything along these lines that could be oh, that could be done for the for the jungle. My best thought right now is like a, a modified version of Gatling Gull. like the Railgun Raven. <laughs> there's, there's something. I'm using my blanks. I love it. I love it. He is definitely easier than the old king. 
But is that really a problem? I don't know. That's really a problem. Oh, oh my God. No! Okay. Uh. No! That's the exit. Well, we didn't have any keys anyways. Okay, well, I didn't know that was the exit because that's an abnormal exit, but I guess I should have guessed because it is uh, for pooping, silly. But I don't... So, yeah, I don't even know what is up to the north. Because, it, yeah, it's just a normal door, you know? It's just a normal door, so you assume, like, that's how you just you go to the next room. So maybe, maybe like, um, that little hazard sign that sometimes get, gets used for, uh, the, the special alt floors, uh, in the expanded dungeon pack, I would maybe slap that on that exit to make it clear that it's not just a normal room. But, like, other than, other than that, which is, like, hardly that big of a deal, because I do understand how I could have probably just maybe guessed that that was the exit. It's, uh, yeah, I, I think that that's, like, literally, that's the only note. That boss, you madman. I'm, just like, a, a guaranteed black chest at the end of every floor, though, is nuts. Like, it might, the reward might be too good. It might be too good. But I don't know because I didn't get it. I do, like, whatever you do, definitely don't unlock that chest. Like, I'm not, sorry, I'm not telling, I'm not telling the commenters. You can unlock that chest if you want. I, it it definitely needs to be a locked black chest. It needs to be a locked black chest. Holy moly. That, yep, I love it. I, I gotta say, is it my, it might be my favorite the whole floor now? Just that, that, the boss really like, I don't know, it just, it leaves an impression. It, it, so it's, it's nice, like, he could maybe be made harder? if he's supposed to be equivalent to the old king but i don't know i don't know i think it was i think it was fine difficulty we do pretty good damage we have a nice nice enough build we might have just been uh, we might have just done well it's all it's you know one run is always a hard uh hard judge holy moly holy moly but uh i layout wise i dig it Difficulty wise, I dig it. It may maybe it's maybe it's too easy. Uh but I don't even know. Because it's supposed to, the thing to remember is it's before the black powder mine. It's probably it, you know what? It's probably what am I talking about? It's on a better difficulty curve than the freaking Abbey of the True Gun. The Abbey of the True Gun is shouldn't be I mean, it's I don't know what I'm talking about, man. The Abbey the True Gun is is too hard for where it is in the game. Like, I'm not saying it like, oh, it's too hard for me. I can't beat it. But it's more just like the difficulty curve of where it's located in the game is weird. So what am I talking about? I feel it's totally appropriate. That's like, no, don't. It's it's good. It's it's. I think it's good difficulty. The question, the question does come in at, uh, is it too strong? To, to get a guaranteed black chest because I do know that that is the reward Apache did did tell me that that is the uh, that is a guaranteed reward the fact that it's locked makes it better the fact that you can't get uh, the extra mast around there too like you can in the jungle I think makes it makes it better as well I don't know maybe here's a I don't know like a weird weird pitch maybe it's like the kind of thing where you you could sacrifice something to get to get the black chest that could be fun like you can sacrifice a master round to get it somehow i don't know that's my only it's my only idea because that could be a way where you get to keep the fun power but you also are like i don't even need my hp and then you also if you didn't play well enough to get the master rounds up to that point you don't even get the reward i think that might be that might be an interesting uh way to balance it out i don't know how hard that is to 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 achieve but that I, I like the idea of a black chest it's it's a fun one but it might need like a uh, a balancing push in the other direction since like that's a it's a better reward than you get for the abbey the true gun and the abbey the true gun is harder 
That being said, wait, you get a guaranteed synergy chest from the Abbey the True Gun. I don't know. That's pretty good, too. Obviously, like, a synergy chest can be better than a black chest. For sure. Oh, depends on what you get. Life's like a synergy chest. My only issue, now that I'm thinking about it, with the alt floor, and it's not even an issue with the alt floor, it's an issue with alt floors in roguelikes in general, is that we're 45 minutes in the episode, and we're on the third floor. What's up with that? You know what we probably do from here on out? I think we take that path, we get the rat key, we skip the fourth floor. I think that's the meta. I think that's the meta. Because otherwise these dang, dang videos are going to get longer and longer. What is our chest RNG today? I mean, it's because we... Uh, I know what it is. It's because we, uh, we didn't have the keys to open up those black chests. I can't believe he didn't junk them. I just cringed, Muriel. Heavens to Betsy. I can't handle it when a YouTuber misplays. <laughs> I know. I, In my defense, I, I would have probably gone back. I just didn't. I, I exited the floor on accident without knowing. Heavens. I want freaking keys probably none for sale this is depressing this is the pretzel okay why am I doing this it's not what I want to do do we have enough coolness for this to be the strats I think so that was tight 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 timing Okay. Even if he goes Inviso Bill, we can still get him with them crits. Mr. Oops. No, 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 no. No, not like this. Not like this. Thank you. Always a fun item to get. Always a fun item to get. I am disappointed! We've used up a lot of our blanks, like, a lot of times here. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, boy. Oh boy. On to the next. Hopefully we get glass cannon from the smelter. That would be great. That would be great. Forty-eight minutes on the hollow. Forty-eight minutes on the hollow. But yeah, if we skip the hollow, if we did the rat, well, first of all, we'd have to do the rat, and then skipping the hollow, eh, I don't know what, probably saves five, ten minutes, five minutes, six minutes, seven minutes, maybe eight, <laughs> maybe four and a half, maybe five and a half, maybe six and a half. Who knows? The possibilities are endless. But yeah, that's just that's just always been my uh, my core. That's one core problem I have with how a lot of Rolex do do alt floors. I do appreciate so much that it was not added in this in the way where uh, you can go to you go to the sewers, then you go to the jungle, then you go to the second floor, then you go to the uh, the abbey, then you go to the belly, then you go to the third floor, then you go to the rat floor, then you go to the fourth floor, then you go to the RNG department, then you go to the forge, then you go to bullet hell. God dang, man. That very easily could have been the reality. And that, you better believe, as soon as that exists, you know what happens when that exists? 
Everyone tells me nonstop to do that run. <laughs> That's what happens when that exists. And I don't got time for that. I have other series to run. And they're all very, very good. <laughs> Can't just spend two hours on one run every day. Oh, no. What did we get? We didn't get... I forgot we had this. This is actually really strong right now. Deep up. But yeah, like, I, I always say... At about an hour, I stop caring about the I stop caring about the specific run we're on anymore. Oh, that's right. We could also go to uh, we could also go to that floor, which is not necessarily uh, faster than just doing it normal. I don't think. Even though that does let you skip the skip the uh, the forge. I don't know. There's a, there's a method to figure things out, but I actually you know like I do I do really like the. The rat floor has always been my favorite bonus floor in the uh, the base game. I like them. I like them. Punch out's a, a nice goofy little uh, little breakup of the you know the normal game formula. Why is this doing so much damage? I mean, I know the synergy's good, but like, what's happening? Why, why are we doing so much damage with it? Is there synergy with something else, too? No. Beep, 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 beep. Bop, 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 bop. Da, 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 Okay. Ooh, long. Always a good time. Always a good time. Are these... These are... Totally squares. <laughs> totally squares. Fill that sucker up. Gotta love it. Gotta love it. Up, up, and around. Up, up, and down. One extra key. Don't mind me. But yeah, we don't even have the rat key. We can't go to that. Oh, what the hell? What do we have for curse? Three. Gatling Mushroom or Grey Guanstone. I gotta go with the Gatling Mushroom. Stand your ground. What? Cousin of the better known bustling fungus, the symbiont symbiontic mushroom. Symbiontic. Symbiotic? Mushroom has shown marvelous adaption to the Gungeon's environment. Though... Thought it has completely lost the ability to heal the host the original species had. It can help in a more direct Gungeon Suit fashion, namely by giving the host a gigantic Gatling gun. Powerful tool, as it is, still retains the original species' signature defense mechanism and will hide when hit or jostled by a dodge roll. Needing around 20 seconds to, get to gather its composure again, and the gun's really heavy. What? It's a passive. What's happening? Lost the ability to heal the host. Gives the host a gigantic Gatling gun. When we get hit or what? When do we get the gigantic Gatling gun? What are you talking about? What do you want about? I want to get hit just to see if I get a Gatling gun now. Nope. Yep. Ah. Until we dodge roll. Oh man, this is crazy. Until we need to dodge. It's an interesting trade off. I wish that, what, here's my one pitch. When the room's over, oh God, I don't know if I can do it. When the room's over, Give me my moves feedback. No, no, no. No, no, no. No, no, no. Oh, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. That's a, that's a lot of low movement speed. Like I always say, movement speed downs are a very touchy 
Very touchy thing to work with. They should be used so sparingly. Because I have a I have a movement speed up right now. Wait, what? I didn't get hit, did I? I didn't get hit. Every 20... What? Every 20 seconds? Oh, God. Every 20 seconds? Is that what happens? Or... Or what? Oh, no. I mean... Well... I don't... I... Hmm... Hmm... <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm still I'm on the fence. I'm figuring I don't I don't know what I feel about it yet. It's it sure as hell is pretty interesting. You know what? The fact that you just get it every 20 seconds is pretty interesting due to the fact that now that I remember I know that and I processed it fully. Uh the hell? Key of chaos what about? All right. Well, one second. Now that I processed it fully, I know that we don't need to just walk in between room to room with it. Disorganizes chest, but adds a chance to not consume a key. Item made by nearly a god who didn't like to sort his storage. He wished he could open all chests without any keys and decided to make this item. He almost succeeded. Sorry, he almost succeeded. But a part of his disorganized nature is now in this key, messing up everything it touches. So all of the chests have different tiers now? Okay. I've always thought that uh, that'd be fun. It's, you know, it's chaos from Bonnie of Isaac. Uh, so now, like, we could get a black chest item and a brown chest. But we could also get a brown chest item and a black chest. Brown chest item and a black chest. Black chest item and a brown chest. Baloney only. No! My run is long enough, thank you! Oh, shoot. We do have to... No! Is it worth it? One, I mean, it's a key for an item. So I guess, okay. Dang it. Key for an item, so I guess it's probably worth it. Nope. No, it's not. Vengeful Rock. Any creature that harms this stone's bear shall be harmed in kind, blood on the blood, and has always, always been. We are at nine curse now. That's bad. That's bad. Oh, God. Oh, man. You know. Man, you know. It's going to happen here. And I ain't gonna be ready for it. Where is it now? I want it now. Right now, give it to me. Okay. If we could more freely use our key, our, our blanks, it would feel better. See, like, right now, this does feel pretty... Uh, it feels pretty cool, but it's like... Uh, I don't, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not sure, man. It might not be a... Uh, a thing I'll usually pick up. I think... I think there's a way... To make it... More... Satisfying... To use. I think there's a way to make it more satisfying. I don't have an idea in my head right now. Oh, look. It warp. No synergy, though. That would be preposterous. I think there was an unused synergy in the game. Probably one that's like, and you Vorpal a lot more. But it probably gave everybody a freaking headache. No point not to use our blanks. Oh, there it is. Bop, 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 bop. Onward. Entering the forge, and it's man and air. Off I go, then. Okay. We're gonna book it. I'm gonna wreck it. 
Another glass guanstone. Never got ourselves. Oh. We can do this. Not never got ourselves a uh, a glass guan or uh, not glass guan, so a glass cannon. Okay, that's the situation to get. I'm gonna try to use it because I think that I think that it has value. Oh no. I think it has value. Beep, beep, bop, 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 yeah, I, I want to stack up our, uh, our blanks again. I miss that. Here's the thing that sucks. It resets what gun I'm holding. The, the item needs a little work. The item needs a little work. It resets the gun I'm holding. It's back to... Uh, it, not back to my, my one that I want to hold. Which is a problem. is a problem I think I'm gonna have to it may be it, it may be one of the the guns uh, first items I kind of have to I, I think I might have to drop it I think I might have to drop it conceptually I like the idea I like what it's going for I think it needs some quality of life tweaks to make it better See, like right here though like obviously it was really helpful right there but it can't i i know that it's probably not an issue it, it, hell it might not even be a thing that can be fixed for all i know but the fact that it keeps on spinning us out to the wrong gun is it's it's sad uh, it's pretty unuser friendly okay so it doesn't really it doesn't matter what uh what chests we open now they're all the same the hell is this taped magazines killing for blood reloading for tape sometimes someone stuck a bunch of magazines together with duct tape there's a small chance you might be able to reuse that if you kill something before reloading there's a small chance you might be able to reuse the tape if you kill something before reloading what? Phrasing? Kill, I'm gonna kill a lot of things before reloading. Hold on. Did you give me stats? Reload time down, clip size up. Clip size way up. Good morning. Rochambeau! Oh man. I love Rochambeau. It's so satisfying. Explosive rounds are obviously good too, but like. We've used those. Um. Why is our shot not coming from our gun anymore? Fix it. Right. Am, am I crazy? Is it always like that? Is this always like this? Oh no. Oh no. Yeah. It's worth. What? What? It gives us duct tape? Okay. Some. Okay. Okay. Some of these are nuts, man. That's crazy talk. This is crazy talk. Infinite duct tape? Kill before reloading. Uh, what the hell is happening here? I don't, I don't get what activates it, but like... Did we get it with this? Because we never have to reload. We never have to reload here. Gives you duct tape if you kill before reloading. I. What a strange concept. 
Let me get out of the way. Oh my god. <laughs> Best dodger in town. Best dodger in town. Okay. How many more duct tape do we get? Because it didn't take us that long to get a duct tape. Bip, bip. Oh. Juke. <laughs> Where are you? Where are you? Is? Man, it's just making the run take longer, man. Alright. We got another duct tape? Are you crazy? What the hell? What? I mean Okay. Alright, you've had your you've had your you've had your fun. It's a duct tape every gun run now. Jesus. What is this? What is this? This is I, I don't think I need to tell say to anyone this item is unbalanced as hell. <laughs> like this is probably the least balanced <laughs> item I've ever seen. So broken strong. Like maybe I don't know how to get the uh to get the duct tape. Maybe the the fact that we had the infinite ammo gun was was making it happen, but quite frankly, I don't need more duct tape. Like I don't need more at this point. Like, it's fine if we. If, it's fine to me if we never get more duct tape, because this is already bonkers. Would like ammo, I guess. That guy, he he, he lasted. Crazy. No, 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 could be anything. It could even be a boat. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? We <laughs> really, really? Spare key, trusty lock, fix baby good mimic. Eh, hey, baby good mimic is obviously way more fun when you actually have a pet already. Yeah, I think the infinite ammo gun was helping us generate more uh, more duct tape quicker, but like I am fine with this Do we have anything that's an infinite ammo eh. No funny thing is I think we're better off using this against the boss. Is there a blank here? Nope Alright. Off I go then. I just realized Ring of Chest Friendship with this would be hilarious. The uh, the chaos item. That's like uh it's a miracle item. Cause you get you mostly get brown chests, but if they can be anything, like if you could get a black chest item from it, that's busted. That's a dream run right there, right there. Maybe Vorpal, the Vorpal crits break damage gap. I didn't think they did. Didn't think they did. Maybe they do. I don't know. Hour 10 and we have any man about hell. Humana, humana. My schedule's in trouble. There was a mod that just made all the floors a little bit less big. <laughs> it could be called, uh, <laughs> it could be called, uh, shrink the gungeon instead of expand the gungeon. Just made like a couple less floors generate per floor, or uh, a couple less uh, rooms generate per floor. It would make a really big difference. Huh. 
Oop, oop. I feel like we might have missed something, but like I'm, I'm fine with missing something right now. I'm just gonna book it to the boss if I can. We have not been generating any more duct tape, so that really does lead me to believe that with the infinite ammo gun, it was happening. I, I guess, like, I mean, it makes sense killing enemies before you reload. What else could do that? Maybe this with the, uh, this with some vorpal shots or something. Come on, vorpal, 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 vorpal. Definitely not reloading. I'm farming duct tape now. Okay. No reloading. Okay. What is it like maybe kill? Oh, he's a cube. Kill 10 enemies without reloading. Or something. Entering a room with a mimic. I don't want a blank. So we lose a lot of damage. Like a lot of damage. I tried. Well, I mean, technically, still haven't reloaded. Is there anything else that doesn't really need to reload? Maybe it's not as busted as I thought, but it's still like, it seems like there's a way to have it be busted. Uh. 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 Oh no. This room has always been a problem. Always. It's one of the only rooms that's like been a problem forever. And it's just still the same. Son of a gun. Give me a little more wiggle room. God dang it. If any of them are jammed, the room is like five times as hard. If even a single one is jammed, it's it's a nutso room. If there's if they're all not jammed, it's fine. It's like different. It's completely different. Okay. I think that's the way to do it. That's more fun. It's more fun and it's uh, f like faster. And I think it might be more reliable too. Cuz the hitboxes are kind of janky in the game sometimes. Not not often. Not often. Oh boy. Ammo. Ammo though. How about some ammo though? Oh no, 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 no. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. We don't have like a lot of great stuff because we haven't been getting, oh no. We haven't been getting uh, a lot of keys. Heck. Oh uh, no, I just don't, like I really don't feel like I have the tools to deal with this stuff right now. Also, I guess like the uh, the duct tape thing. This is not where I want to be. The duct tape situation too is like, oh my god, this is hell. <laughs> the duct tape situation too probably does eat a decent amount of our uh, of our ammo capacity. Cause yeah, the shotgun. No, I'm stupid. Oh no, we might die today. Oh no, I would hate that if we could leave. Hop. Okay, okay, okay. We got another duct tape. Damn 
There we go. Even crazier time. Okay. Down we go. Oh. I could have actually taken a hit there. Doot, doot, doot. Feels like we might have added a, a... I need to take a look at some of these dang items. Might have added a pack that has someone who's go, who wants wants the runs to go on a power trip. And I'm not really like look. I'm not really looking for power trip runs to be honest. And I know it's ironic that it's, I'm saying that on a run where we're like dying right now, but we're we're dying due to like a little one, a little bit of jank, and a little bit of stupidity. Seems like we're getting like guaranteed crits here. Next. Oh, he jammed. Oh, he jammed. No, not guaranteed crits. Da, 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 da. I mean, the further this goes, I should stop reloading, I guess. Because we might get more duct tape. Come on, sir. Sir. Yeah. Go on up. Get that key. Go on out. Please save me. Dear God. Dear God. Next. Next. I guess it's just like, there's probably a lot of crits due to the fact that we have warful bullets too, and we're just, we are firing just on like a lot of shots. Okay. Long room, but I, uh, I feel like our type of gun should really handle this just okay. Just A-okay. It's, uh, you know, it's like five guns. It's like five guns. Five guns, burgers, and uh, funds. Five guns, burgers, and buns. There we go. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. That's what the game is saying. The frame rate there. Why must I do this to myself? Did get another comment telling me I suck at Gungeon? <laughs> that happened yesterday. It's, it actually made me laugh. I'm not, like, maybe I'm not playing well today, though. But, like, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay mister. Ooh. I mean, the reward for that room is nice. It, it it makes me less upset than it used to, for sure. Well, I mean, probably because it got changed. It got, it got, it got tweaked to be more user friendly. The reward is the reward is nice, and a lot of times it outweighs the uh, the str the strife it puts you through. Because you're statistically probably gonna get ammo back, which is normally the uh, the bigger issue of the room. Because like. I feel like if you could choose exactly which consumable you put on the ground, it'd be a different story. Like, it, they probably wouldn't choose to put three things on the ground, but the fact that you can't pick what the consumable is, you know, it makes a difference. Makes a difference. They, you got kind of, kind of have to put in three. Oh my God, this. This room is always so mean. Uh, we're fine. We're fine. We, we're getting there. We're almost done. We're almost free. I have to sneeze, though. <coughs> and a second time. Really giving me them, them duct tape every gun run vibes. Okay. <laughs> we 
We didn't even kill him. Wait, what? Did we kill his ads? What? Ha what? What? But yeah, I just... Man, I gotta figure out ways to make the... Because I do want to go to the belly of the beast, but I don't want my run to be this long. So we gotta, I want to figure out a way to make it, to make them shorter. If you have any ideas for good, good ways to make them shorter while sacrificing the least amount of run integrity, I would love to hear them. For now, I uh, patiently <laughs> await a mod that just makes the <laughs> makes the floors 10% smaller. 15% smaller. Because a lot of, especially a lot of the modded rooms, they really, really want to be big and stand out. I don't even know what the hell to add. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Oh my god, the crits are off the charts with the bubbles. I'm poisoned! And I can't even see where the poison is. That's a base game issue, that's what that is. That's not... That ain't no mod thing. For some reason, if you put poison pools in this floor, they don't show up. I don't know why. It's really weird. But that is gonna do it for today, dear god! I hope you enjoyed... The, the, the chunky chunky run today. And the, uh, the belly of the beast floor. I very, very, very much did. And that's why... I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I want to figure out how to make it work. I want to figure out how to make it work. So we can go there. Without having the runs, uh, be this long. Because I'm just... I'm having issues with getting... Um, you know, yesterday there was no Gungeon. And it's because the Gungeon episodes are so long. That's why I couldn't get one yesterday. I didn't... I actually ended up not having as much time as I thought. So if they're all this long, I might be missing days. So we'll see. That's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. I greatly appreciate any and all support. We should live on the series up to this point. Extra special thank you to D-Hex, Throbo, Nadelric, Justice, Tom, The Shogun, Gun, More Than Awesome, Semicolon, P, and Patricia for supporting our Patreon at the Go Team Dungeon tier, helping me do this full time at a time where I could not otherwise. If you want to help out the channel without paying any money, you can click the like button. It takes half a second and helps me stay full time with this as my job, it takes half a second. You can do it by the time this video is over. I'm going to keep talking for a second to prove my point even more. It could have already been clicked by now, and it helps a lot. Thank you very much. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.